Hey guys, um, what I want to talk to you about today uh, is uh, Reserve Bank and some of the sort of monetary policy tightening that we're seeing in the market, um, obviously designed to slow down particularly Auckland, um, but arguably now also the rest of the country. Um, there's been a bit of noise in the media about um, the Reserve Bank looking at servicing type calculations. I think a lot of people are a little bit nervous about that. Um, I don't think you're going to see anything like the LVR changes that we saw um, you know, 18 months, two years ago, and, and more recently with property investors. Um, but what you are going to see is the Reserve Bank having much more closed conversations with banks around the way that they're assessing borrowers. You've seen some early um, examples of that. We, we now have some restrictions around um, foreign buyers, particularly um, the Reserve Bank uh, quietly uh, has put in place that the banks can't rely on foreign-based income um, for servicing New Zealand-based debt. Uh, and that will have a reasonably significant impact. It's not only going to stop um, or reduce the amount of um, foreign buyers um, uh, buying here in, in the instance that they need to borrow money, um, it's also going to stop New Zealand residents who have been quite active property investors um, from being able to use foreign based income to support the servicing. Uh, if you think about it, a lot of uh, recent New Zealand uh, residents um, don't necessarily have high incomes here and so historically they have relied on offshore income to um, justify the level of borrowing and the amount of property that they've been purchasing. Um, that's all going to be a lot tougher now. Um, our sense is that that will free the market up, particularly in Auckland. Um, not to a huge degree, but it doesn't really take moving the dial too much um, for us to sort of see the benefit and I think the benefit is going to be uh, that it's going to be easier for first home buyers um, and for people who are buying owner-occupied property. So that's it for, for this one, um, I'll see you next time.